Hey Queens and Kings, welcome back and thank you guys so much for watching as well as returning. If you all would like to see how I made these gorgeous gray geometric candle holders, please continue to watch. So here's the items that you will need. Three of Dollar Tree gray candle holders, as well as one pack of napkin rings. Four of the gray geometric tea light holders. Two of Dollar Tree little silver trinkets trays as well as some diamond wrap. Fix all adhesive or E6000, hot glue gun as well as glue stick and a pair of scissors. Okay, Queens and Kings, so we have flipped over one of our trinkets trays and we're applying the adhesive to the back of it as well as some hot glue and we're gonna use this trinket tray as our base to our candle. Next, we're gonna place one of our gray geometric candle directly on top of that square so the bottom of the square of the geometric candle actually meets with the bottom of the trinket tray. So square meets square. And then we're gonna take one of our napkin rings, we're gonna apply uh, some fix all adhesive as well as the hot glue, and we're gonna place that directly in the center of that geometric candle holder. But before we do that, we're gonna apply some hot glue to the inside of the geometric candle holder. So therefore we can place our napkin ring and it can secure faster. On top of that first napkin ring, we're gonna place some more hot glue as well as some fix all. And after that, we're just gonna place our gray candle directly, candle holder directly on top of it. So that is it for the first candle for now. We'll set that to the side. Now we're gonna do our second candle. And here we're not gonna use the trinket tray as our base. All we're gonna do is repeat the steps. We're gonna use two of the geometric candle holders as well as two of the napkin rings. And we're gonna repeat the same steps. Okay, queens and kings, so now that we have finished that, where our base and our candle holder meet, we're just gonna place some hot glue and one script of the bling wrap around to the bottom of that just to give it a clean and elegant look. So moving along to the very last layer of this candle holder. Here you see that I have two scripts of the layers of diamond wrap and all I'm gonna do is just wrap it around where you see 
that gray base at the bottom of this kind of hole just to give it a even and elegant look. Here I have a little jewel and I decided to place a jewel there because it did look a little plain. I want to bring a little more glam to my elegant candle holder so all I did was just put some glue down and place the jewel directly on top of that. Okay queens and kings so this is how they turned out. Yes I did three. It was not right if I didn't do three which I did not show you guys the third one because I showed you guys the first one and the second one and the first one is identical to the third one. So, but this is how they all turned out. This is the look that I was going for. I love the perfect shade of gray. I love the elegance about these. I love the glam about them. I love everything about them because it speak Val. It speak to me, speak to my soul. If you all enjoyed the video as much as I did, enjoyed making these, please go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. Comment down below as well as share with your family and friends. And subscribe if you're new to the castle because I would love for you to be a part of the family. With that all being said, I will talk to you queens and kings in the next video. Love you guys. Have a blessed day. Bye.